Okay. <laughs> Welcome back, everyone. We are at the end, nearly, of the lineup review for Wednesday, the 6th of, of November. I just said 11, 11 but amazing. Hello, done. can you hear me? Hello, Hello. and Hello. we are here with Hello, Crimson, Crimson Artists. And oh, there Crimson, we go, finally. Crimson is here. What is the name of your ship, buddy? This is the Super Harvester World Reaper. The you Super know, Harvester I'm, World Reaper. It's totally Reaper. not a bite off of your World Eater, Tom. <laughs> hey, mate, oh, this, is the, this is the Super Harvester. That's... That's like a whole other level, man. Yeah, it's like even more hardcore. Exactly, because it's, it's implied in the name. Super Harvester. Epic. Alright. So, so without further ado, let's hop into it. Yeah, look at this. Where are you guys? I'm floating around you in my core. Okay. Oh, look at that little island in the back. Or uh, you can see from the top of the uh, ship, there's little glass. Oh, I'm just yeah, still going down the belt line around the sides on the outside. Eventually, I'll make it to the top. <laughs> and he's slowly, slowly moving forward. At a crawling pace. That's okay. I appear to have forgotten to take shadows off again. Which is strange. <laughs> yeah, I did. Looks like I've had shadows on the whole time. Oh well. Oh. Been looking great. <laughs> That's the way to do it, though, isn't it? Yeah. Really. I'm thinking about moving the uh, sector location to a different... The only reason we, we use 808 is because it's directly underneath the sun and the sun's far away. So you get the light from above, but it, you don't get blinded by looking up at all, you know. The shadows are all wondering straight that, down. It's That's really why. Dark. Yeah, I mean, we might move it to like an equivalent of 858. With the map now, it's really easy to figure out where to go. You don't have to do maths. Anymore <laughs> to work it out. <laughs> yep. Look at this. See, I've finally made it to the top, and then I've got to go to the bottom. So, so many different ways of joining up your holes to take inspiration from here, guys. You may have seen a lot of them before. Oh, I found it. A Deptiligan. Only the mighty know how to use the Deptiligan. <laughs> well, basically, it's supposed to be a hologram. Oh no, it's a particular way of joining up your wedges, man. It takes really? people ages to work out. Yeah, like because you've done it a few times. You're even doing it with your Penta, which hmm. is interesting. Yeah, like people, it's a bit like a jigsaw puzzle. It takes people stages to figure out how the, how you can put the pieces together to make the shapes that you want. And I call one of them the Deptiligan, because basically it's either a wedge and a penta and a corner on its side, or a penta and a penta and a corner on its side. I'm looking at one right now on the stream. But you can hmm. do this and then replicate that in various ways, which allows you to do more complicated shapes than just... Do, uh, you know, than just an oct octahedrons. I think that's the right word. Octahedrons. Because that's all you get out of the pentatetra. I, I didn't even know the, mo the names of most of these things. I just do it because it looks Oh, good. I just made it up. I don't think Deptiligan <laughs> is an actual name. It's not even a word. <laughs> to be honest, you're Pretty making... Sure it's not actual. Term. No, no. You're making a, you're making a, a poly polyhedron out of the, the shape set that we've got, you know. That's the trick. You're making geometry. Yeah, yeah, yeah you, you, you're doing it, man. You're doing it. I was never realizing it. <laughs> oh my god, he's doing it. <laughs> oh, look under here. Wait, what? The lighting pops in and out if I go too far away. Because it's uh -oh. awesome. Wait, no. Oh, there we go. Okay, so we've finally gotten to the point where I need to find a door. How quickly can I find a door? There it is. Charge! Oh. There you go. Thank you very much. Oh. What? They're all logic tri triggered, sorry. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god. The door is eating you! Ah. You might want to get out of your core for this one. Nah, nah. It's fine. You can do it. You can it's do like it. a mini game. Let's go for that core room, yo. Ah, ch -ch 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 -ch. Okay. <laughs> you shall not pass. Yes! It works fine. 
I just need to go faster. Oh, you notice uh, right in front of his core, he's got a little display module where if you go in there, you can actually see part of the text. In energy storage, shield strength readout. Very nice. Yeah. Oh yeah. Auto salvage. Oh. Yeah. Basically, I connected two of the um, of the salvage computers together mm -hmm. and just l use a logic clock on it. So you, you see, you just you basically can have it on and just kind of drift and just collect. I like it. Nice. I'm gonna go build mode from here. Crimson, would you like to activate your auto eating? Great. Oh, um, it would be my pleasure. Boop. Oh God. Ah, yeah. Just checking out the crew quarters. Tom, you need to see this thing. So I, right, I'm slowly getting there. You got your reactor rooms exposed. I like that. When it's when there's a reason for it, I like it. Airlocks are legit. That's interesting. Oh, you've got a med bay on the side of the airlock. Is that captain's quarters? All oh, right, yep. quality. Nice little checkerboard on the floor there. Bit of style. Is that an escape pod docked in the back underneath the observation deck? Uh, no, that is. Um, that's med the pickaxe drop pod. It's the auto miner I I, I made. Uh, med bay's nice. Nice touch with the glass on I top of the partition there. The, that trash pod I made earlier, but yeah. Docking bays, reactor room, mission control. Where's mission control? Up the stairs? Oh no, out there. Docking bays. Oh wow, spacious. This docking bay is like way bigger than it looks. It's like a Navy SEAL boat thing. Boat drop. What the heck is this? It has to be upside down. Oh, so. that's, the, uh, that's his auto miner. What, this? A little ball thing. But we're in the actual cargo bay area. Wait, ball, what, what? Say that again? This is the very bottom of your ship with a giant uh, hangar. You mean the, the pod that's, that's, that's attached to the bottom? Yeah. Nope, uh, right in front of that. There's a ramp leading to the uh, doors in front of area. it. Yeah. The back here? Or. Say that again? I'm getting, a little, I'm getting a little confused. I think here. he said it was a trash pod, didn't he? No, no, no. That, that's the, um. I wanted to replace it. That's that's the auto miner. It's basically it's like, it's you drop it on a planet, and as soon as it hits the ground, it it triggers um the auto clock on it. So the auto miner. So basically, it it starts eating the eating up the planet. As soon as it hits the ground, you just like it's like a torpedo. Oh, you'll have to show me that at some point, right? We're gonna have to basically call the review there because. This needs I want to show everything off. Yeah, because there's too much. I need to show off this ship proper. I'm not going to be able I'm to do it. Sorry about that. I kind of came no, no. a too late. No, 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 no. It's fine. Whoops. Whoa. 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 I'm getting eaten by the dough. Uh-oh. Okay. It's okay. I made it. I'm a trooper. Oh, no. I'm not. Wait, where I'm are dead. You? I'm not. I'm getting out. Oh, wait. Is the trigger... The trigger's in a horrible place. Go! Yes! I, I love the style that you have on these ships, mainly because if I go far away, they still look interesting to look at. Of course, it likes, it's incredibly lit up, so... <laughs> mm -hmm, that's what I mean, and I like bright ships. Sci-fi... Yep. ...can never have enough lens flare. <laughs> All the rich directors have proved this. J.J. So, Abrams? Yes. <laughs> yep, so there it is. If it ain't fix, if it ain't broke, don't fix it, right? Yep. And yeah, you got a really gonna... interesting design in here, man. But we're gonna have to do a proper review on it, and you can give me the guided tour, and then you All can right. show me because I need to see this thing work. I need to see you drop this thing, but we All can't right, so... do it now. All right, just just tell me when, dude. I'm always ready. All right, you ready to jump? Yep. Wow, he really is ready. Okay. Here we go. Whenever you're Three, ready, man. Two, one. Holy crap, you went the other way. Gone. <laughs>